Look how, look how clear it is. Look at that clarity. I've seen that. That's the benefit of the iPhone. Oh, this is this is you not opening it now. You've already opened this. Yeah, I've already opened it. Right, right, right. I think I. He's yeah. got the concept. I did know. I did know that, but I think I forgot. I will say um, these packs were so difficult to actually open. Like, they were, I don't know if you had that rhyme with yours, but ah, I think generally they were fine for me. I could not open them for anything. I mean, it probably wasn't as bad as how I butchered uh, the Vivid Voltage opening to be fair. That was <laughs> terrible. No, these were, I had to use that little knife to uh, open all of them. My fingers went up for it. I don't know what any of these um, little symbols on the, on the sides mean. Is that just all the Pokemon that are in the set? Uh, that, yeah, that's a, that's a checklist. It's like when you, um, it's like when you get a tin of uh, Quality Street. <laughs> it's a different flavour. I'd suggest that that is a checklist of all of the V's and V maxes that you can get in the set. Yeah. So what uh, what years did these GX ones come out? Uh, so this is this is tag team stuff. So this is all the tail end of Sun and Moon. Um, so these these are all have come out 2018, 2019. Did you play the uh, the game on the DS, Sun and Moon? That that's the one one like branch I didn't play at all the Sun and Moon. I, uh, yeah, I've never played Gen 7. I didn't I didn't play it. Uh, but from what I've seen, like it looks terrible. Uh, it can't have been as bad as uh, eight as a uh, Sword and Shield, though, surely. <laughs> well I like there's like there's like some weird kind of uh, like uh, dimensional rift or thing and there's like loads of have you seen like some of the Pokemon in this game? It's like uh, they're like kind of abstract concepts <laughs> rather than actual things. <laughs> I have to. I have to give you an example. There was also they, they don't have they don't have gyms in the traditional sense either. They have like because it's based around like Hawaiian culture. They have uh, these guys called the Big Kahunas. Giratina. I mean, this guy came up. It's my little Paul. And this guy, Girachi. 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 Oh, I love that, that trio. That's a sick, that's a sick card, yeah, I like that. Yeah, I completely butchered how you um, how you do the card, the card trick, as it were. When I opened mine, I didn't, I, didn't, I mean, I didn't record mine, but they're, uh, this one is just like the back five cards are pretty much all holographic in some respect. Yeah, there's there there was three cards in there that I thought were pretty good. I didn't, I didn't realize that you could get three um, rare, rare ones. You normally get, well, I think it's, you get at least two hollows, and then you get uh, one GX, and then you get. Um... Oh wait, I just realised earlier I was talking about V's and V maxes like an absolute fool. These are GXs. Uh... So yeah, you get two at least two hollows, a GX, and then you'll have your reverse on the back. But then you can have like an extra. You can get a third hollow. Uh, I've also had two GXs, so. That is sick. I, I, when I went to Japan, uh, I bought a, I bought a single pack of this before I even knew it was good. Like I bought a single pack of this from the from the Pokemon Center in Tokyo. Yeah, and I, I put that I pulled that card out of it. It has a, a special place in my heart. And I like these as well. The um, the energy cards. They're all. Um, is it? I want to say they're not hollow. Are they they're reverse hollow? I don't really know. How... They're they're classed as reverse hollows. Yeah. Okay. But um, they are realistically holographic, but like they are classed as reverse. If it's on the back, if if it, whatever the last card is on the back of these packs, there are reverses. Honestly, Fort Knox, I couldn't, I couldn't open it. Ah, oh, you're in. You're in there, though. You're in there. Uh, who else do we have? So, yeah, this Ooh. Is me trying to work out if I've done it right. I've thrown one card to the back. That didn't help. I really like that hop it. Uh, little belt. Oh, that water is sick yeah. as well. Water is pretty sick. Eevee in the rain. I don't know what that is. It's Incineroar, but is that uh, like a starter? I don't know what it is. Uh, yeah, it's... it's the. Isn't it the same then as uh, the Rowlet? Uh, yeah, I believe so. It's, yeah, Litten, Rowlet, and Poplio. I think are the one of the three. Oh, thinking of the three. That is a nice one. Another, another trio. Legendary boards. The tag teams are really cool. Yeah. Yeah, they're great. Much more interesting uh, art, art uh, designs, aren't they? Art designs, is that a thing? Of course, but. 
that one in the middle, that that red one. Yeah. I don't. What, I don't know what the um, little diamond means. Uh, so it's uh, in English. I think they're called prism cards or like prismatic. Yeah. So that would be uh, Victini prism or Victini prismatic. And is Victini a? I think it's a legendary. <laughs> okay. Because again, it looks like it should be a starter Pokemon. And I was like, yeah, what is this? It's kind of like a uh, kind of got like a, a fire Stellaby kind of thing going on. Mm. Sorry, that, just fact checking myself. It's a mythical Pokemon, not a legendary Pokemon. I don't know who that is either, but he's reverse, so we'll keep. We'll keep. Uh, can't tell because of the way it's drawn. It's either Zorora or Zorora. I can't quite tell. It looked pretty abstract to me. <laughs> it's, it's just a concept, isn't it? It's not a Pokemon. It's a concept. <laughs> I'm. Like, let me. Uh, let me. Let me Google this. I'm pretty sure there was a thing which was like. A, a surge of electrical energy was like a Pokemon. Oh, Necrozma. I don't know. I think no, no, no. I think that'll be... Necrozma actually... Oh, no, no, it's uh, the... Sorry, it's the Ultra Beast, right? Yes, that's exactly what I'm thinking of, yeah. Yeah, so... They're dumb. The, uh, yeah, they are basically like... You're right. You're absolutely right. They are basically like concepts. Oh, God. <laughs> He's I absolutely I right. Know. Yeah. I did like that. I, I didn't like that uh, when I saw it. Uh, but you know, I need to. I need to get with the times. I think. Yeah, they are very bizarre. <laughs> so weird. Uh, I mean, you know what? I guess you know we criticise them for uh, bland designs. Um, so yeah, they, they've tried something different. Okay, but your favourite Pokemon in the, in the whole Mimic thing? You. I like Mimic. A lot. Some weird ghosty squid. I love the Galarian Diglett Dig Dug Trio thing. That that's they look, great. That's they look like they look like Hanson, don't they? They do, it's so good. So I don't know if that was special. A little tag team Misty and Lots of Cups. No, I have no idea who that one is. Magnus. Oh, and it's the one that I only recently learned about. Hooper. And it's that Dusk uh, what's he called? Dusk Noir. Yeah, I always get them confused. It's because it's just Dusk Clops and there's Dusk Noir. Is that, like, um, is that the next one? Is that like a mega evolution? I cannot recall. But yeah, it's it's one of those two and Troman. Yeah, that guy had loads of weird discs around him. Little hoops, because he's Hooper. Hoop boy. I don't. I, yeah, I didn't didn't really like the uh, Magna Zone. Yeah, he's a bit he's a bit safe, isn't he? Really? Oh yeah, I thought he was pretty shit. He's very very chunky. Chunky. Chunky chunky. Chunky Pikachu. Uh, I found I found the electric one that I was thinking of. Is he's called uh, Zerkitry. Ah. Zerkitry, get it? And, yeah, abstract. Uh, he looks like um, like literally cables and copper wiring. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? <laughs> oh yeah, that one. I've never seen that before in my life. Also, a, uh, a Pokemon that I uh, came across today, which I'd completely forgotten about, mm -hmm. uh, and for some reason, upon seeing it, it stirred some kind of nostalgia, but I can't place the nostalgia at all. Um, I have a connection with this Pokemon for some reason, I don't know why, but it is, uh, it's Donphan. Oh, Donphan's sick. That's Ryan's favorite, isn't it? One Great Pokemon. Favorites. I think, I think, like, I think that would actually probably go into my, uh, my, my fantasy, uh, my top six. Really? My part, yeah, my, my, my fantasy did. I think it would. Oh. Why? I don't know why I like it. I just remember like it. Was it. it was in, um, I think it was like in the in like the opening five minutes of one of the films, or like one of the first few films. Right. There's like yeah. Ash is goes into a battle, and you got Don Fan doing his little rollout stuff. Yeah, um, and I think it's probably because of that that you recall him. Pokemon three, with the one with yeah, it's, it's, in it, maybe it's two or three in my memory. Right, sorry to keep disrupting the video. No, you're, you're fine. Uh, I, I'll have to fill through all of this anyway. It's content. <laughs> this, this was a pretty sick card. I liked. If it was like a hollow, uh, Kangaskhan would be pretty cool. Squirrel, everyone's favorite. Got that in reverse. It's gorgeous. Oh, there he is. Oh my goodness. The, the yeah, squad. Dug trio. Oh. Squad goals. Very nice. I don't know who that is. Why would living in Hawaii give you such long flowing locks is what I want to know. You're a surfer, dude. 
Uh, maybe, maybe you might be on something. Then. And then this guy came out. Sceptile. GX. A bit skeptical about that one. <laughs> See, that's where I got. That's where I got confused about what I was uh, pulling because that doesn't go with Incineroar, does it? Sceptile's Gen Three. Yeah. It's, uh, completely confused there. Trico, Crowbar, Sceptile. That's with uh, like the Torchic lot and Mudkit, right? Correcto. See, that's it. I, I lost interest after Gen Three. Yeah, I was gonna say once it's once it's off the Game Boys, no one cares. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. No, Spiritomb, Spiritomb, and uh, Porygon Z. Love this That's stuff. cute. Oh, sleeve up that reverse. I mean, you got to, you have to sleeve up everything. This is still such a dumb Pokemon. What is it? Is it not, it's not that Apple one, is it? Uh, Cherub. No. Cherub or something. Right? Cherub. Yeah. Let's do all the fruit. Yeah, I get confused around the fruit ones. <laughs> <laughs> They're a grape Pokemon. They must be. Probably. Is there a raisin Pokemon? This one is called Mem Member Berry. I remember. <laughs> oh, look at all these reverse energies. I, th I mean, it'll spoil it, but I'm pretty sure I got a different one for every pack. But ah, spoilers. Maybe, maybe one, maybe one duplicate, but um, no, they're really good. I haven't seen a fairy energy card though, so that, that was uh, that was quite nice. And this ooh, old woman turned up. Is she old? I don't know. I'm, no, she's very young, from what I understand. So she she's from. She's called, she's called Roxy, apparently. Yeah, she's basically the same as Piers from Sword and Shield. Yeah, she's from Black, um, Black and White. She's a, a punk rock gym leader. But so they, like, they really did it twice. Yeah, she, and she, but she, she actually has like a song in her game. But then obviously in Sword and Shield, they didn't do any voice stuff. No. Mewtwo. Oh, Mewtwo, he turned up. Love that. No. And then this or origami thing. Yeah, that's an Ultra Beast. That's uh, what Bert was talking about. And then you got the Dedeni. Dedeni GX. The budget it's a discount team. Pikachu, isn't it? Yeah, you got it. I'm not sure how I feel about the the hollow the hollow border on the Japanese cards. I'll no, go back with some forwards on it. But maybe it depends on the card. And different colours go with it. Probably easy easier scuff. Well, I'm, I'm interested to know what you're saying on the actual video at this point. I'm not. Oh. I just, honestly, I sat quietly and just, <laughs> and just, just opened these up and then walked away after half an hour. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Do you know what I did? Chaos. Absolute chaos. Let's get some, let's get some more sick pulls then. Uh, yeah. I'm trying to think what ones you got. Versus that. I think there's a few ones that I didn't get that you got. I, I, don't, I don't think I got... The Trevenant and Dusk thing, Dusk person. Dusk. No. I, I obviously didn't get uh, Roxy, mm. but I got I got the other four thus far. I feel like I feel like quite common in this set. I think I got most of the hollows that you got as well. Oh well, yeah, with uh, the 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 amount that you get in each pack, like you're bound to get a lot, a good chunk of them. Mm. Ah, it's water. There you go. Oh, I see. I guess there's just yeah, that makes a lot of sense. There's just an energy in every one, right? Yeah. Got ya. Wishy washy. Derpy fish. Wishy washy is pathetic. Have you seen it when it transforms there and it turns into a big scary fish? Ah, Not sorry. when it, it. No, it doesn't evolve. Well, it might do. I can't remember. But like when it actually like transforms, it yeah. transforms into a big school of fish that imitates a giant scary fish. Ah, that's pretty scary. Zapdos. Yeah, it's alright. Stop the, the finest Zapdos artwork that you'll find out there. Blastoise! That's a cool Blastoise though. And then... Oh, What is she? Got... It's called Fer Ferramosa and Buzzwall, I think. Buzzwall, yeah. Buzzwall. Buzzwall. <laughs> he is the, he is a, he is a Chad. He's a Chad of the Pokemon world. He is, yeah, he's a real alpha. <laughs> what chat? Again, some of these Pokemon are just real, real scary. That this is the main event, though. We'll, we'll look at Blastoise some more. That's sick. That's a sick one. You cannot go wrong with Blastoise. GG. Let's get that Zapdos sleeved up. It's like when you returned your Vivid Voltage <laughs> to me, and you'd sleeved you sleeved every single card. Can I have those sleeves back, please? Three hundred and sixty <laughs> cards sleeved. <laughs> <sighs> No, come on, it's my first time. Mm. 
I seriously can't have one back. <laughs> I suppose. I guess I have them somewhere. Oh, this one, making tough work of this one. Making tough work of all of them. What are you saying, Bert? What are you going to go for? Oh. Electricity one. Nail nice. One. Great guess. <laughs> oh, is that reverse Nine Tails? Oh, that's it cool. is. Nine Tails, very nice. Nice Tails, I like to pull it. Ah, flurry on. That's nice. Cityscape in the background. That's pretty cool. Ni nicey on. Bike. Oh, look at that sick bike. This this one this one got me. <laughs> what, yeah, that's like this? from a computer game from like 1997 or something. Yveltal. This one, the one made out of nuts. Mel metal. That that's the one. Nutman. <laughs> yeah, he, they're kind of confusing because they didn't come out. Oh, Ultimate Necrozma. Wow, look at that. It looks like a Digimon. It does. It does a bit, yeah. Can I say that? Am I allowed to say that? It's, no, it's copyrighted. Like what? This isn't Route 1 Digimon, Luke. Digimon. The Digimon still exists. Are they going to come and hunt us down? Digimon! Digimon, dude! Agumar evolves into Greymar. <laughs> it has that cool animation every time. Love it. Digivolve to... <laughs> Did you guys watch the Beyblade uh, anime? Yes, Beyblade! <laughs> I never watched it. I just had Beyblade. <laughs> yeah, I watched a bit of it. Yeah, I remember that was pretty mental. Like they had little uh, the bit the bit monster things that were inside the Beyblade. Oh my yeah. god! Yeah, oh, of course there were. But what was the main one? Was it called Was it called Dragoon? Was that the main one? Yeah, maybe. Then, then you had you had I think they were all like dr sounds. So you had like Dragoon, uh, Drasil. Uh, I think that there was like a t wolf tiger one called Drigger. They were all like dr sounds. Mm, I really imagined it there. Dorothy. Dorothy. <laughs> Dorothy. <laughs> I couldn't think of a dr another drop. <laughs> Dorothy was Drake. a global. Drakey boy. Drakey. Oh, you're knifing it. Slice those cards. Shat man, man shanks uh, <laughs> Pokemon cards. <laughs> Ten hours. Ten hour compilation of that. If you want, if you want clicks on your YouTube video, that's that should be the title, I think. Got a nice dark type energy coming up, have we? Uh, I think it's a leaf one, grassy one. Uh, but I don't know. Who's to say? Fairy energy. Nailed it. That's the Incineroar second one, right? Yeah, it's Lit Leo, I think. Lit Lit Leo. <laughs> what the hell? What is that? I've never seen that before. <laughs> Which? That, like, electric zebra thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Blitzel. Blitzel. Yeah. Wait, well, meet you. <laughs> stone thing. There they go. There's the co the cobblestone house. Oh, so that's pretty cool, actually. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite brutal, isn't it? Who yeah. <laughs> asked you? Know, do I? Yeah, I got a stack attacker, and then I'll see. Up to cool, no. See. Oh, oh, oh nice. Ninja. Greninja Zoroark. Greninja is cool. I like. Because uh, I don't really like his, his tongue scarf. That's always weird. Yeah. yeah that, that was quite a while before I realised that was even his tongue. Yeah. I didn't well know that. Still cool. I was just going to say, anything vaguely uh, cold-blooded, I'm, uh, I'm usually into. Anything reptilian or, an, or, reptilian or amphibian in uh, nature. You like size, size, bit of size do you? Uh, yeah. Why not? <sighs> Yeah. <laughs> I've been known. I've been known to partake in a bit of size and dude. Yeah, let's get that sleeved up. Get it sleeved up real good. I missed that <laughs> one, didn't I? I oh, well, you better get that sleeved up. <laughs> Come on, stop it. If there's one thing you got to do in life, is sleeve your energies, kids, you know? Oh. This is the one. This is the one. Oh. Oh. I'm here, right? Uh, I did it. Munchlax. Munchlax is cool. That gal with a Vanillax. Oh, goodness. Out of all, uh, a very odd looking Persian, yeah. Yeah, I thought I'd stuff on that for you, Ryan, because you love Persians. Yeah, it sounds a bit, sounds a bit up with it. 
And then we got the non-prison Victini. Yep. This guy. Yeah, yeah. I always forget his their whole thing. There's, like, there's a few of them, aren't there? Yeah, they're like cloud yeah. monsters. They're pretty Ooh, cool. Garchomp Giratina. I think you got this one as well, Ryan. I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah. But yeah, that, um, the cloud monster one, is that um, what's going to feature in the next booster box? The battle style one. Uh, yeah, maybe. They go, go pretty heavily on that one, don't they? I always forget he's called La Landorus. Yeah, because you've got Landorus, Thunderous, and Tornadoes. I'm not a fan. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not a fan of them. I'm not a fan of those like Tapu Coco ones. And, Tapu Coco. Tapu Coco and Tapu Lily. Yeah, come on, guys. <laughs> Just because I didn't play the game. Sort this out, Game Freak. Come on now. <laughs> Maybe because I didn't play the game and didn't get into it, but. Like. Like of the most recent gen, like the uh, Zacian and what the other one, the other one, like Zamazenta. Yeah, they they look pretty cool. You can't yeah. really go wrong with like a big wolf thing. I'm still not really sold on Eternatus though. I didn't realize that it was like it's a it's a legendary Pokemon, right? Uh, well, at the risk at the risk of tripping myself up again, I'm going to say yes, but also it might be mythical. I can't remember. Well, either way, they just gave it to you. So <laughs> yeah, I don't actually. I'm not sure if you can not catch that. Yeah, you have to, or else everyone dies, right? Yeah, it's really weak as well. Like it was getting absolutely munched when I uh, battled Leon straight afterwards. Mm. Right, last one. What are you saying? Uh, nice little water energy. Oh, that's the secret rare. Lola Vulpix, so good. I do like the Lola ones. Got that in uh, reverse as well. Real nice. Bird. Thing. <clears throat> Thing. Red running away. Yeah, red fleeing from his problems. Triple colourless energy from what that looks like. And here's one of the Ultra Beasts again. I think this is Nagnardle. It's gonna get you. And then this strange thing. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what that is. <laughs> oh! Saving the battle last. Oh. Ah. I want that. That's that's the pull of the pull of the set. Yeah, I want that. Very nice, mate. That's it. That's your lot. We did it. It was quite something. We really watched that. We did. Let's make sure we sleeve these up. <laughs> See if we let's leave that triple colorless energy, shall we? <laughs> Not gonna do. I feel like you got like four Articunos. I think one hollow and one reverse hollow. Maybe. Mm. Yeah. Well, there's a there's a there's an insta post right there. Your lowlands. I, I do hope they do more uh, regions. Oh, I definitely will. Yeah. And you're gonna have a great time chopping up all this useless <laughs> audio. I, I hate it. No, you love it. Mm. It's giving you something to do, so you love it. Well, after you've edited mine and and done your nice voiceover for it, then oh, we can start uploading them. I'm doing voiceover, man. Yeah, you're the voiceover man. I actually need Luke to give me more uh, music. you will be like, uh, <laughs> and this pack's going to be by Rachel Adedeji! <laughs> Oliver! <laughs> <laughs> Imagine. Do you remember? Um, remember? I remember. Do you remember in uh, on, like, X Factor, the, categor the categories were like <laughs> men's, women, groups, and then like the over 25s? Yeah, huge category. <laughs> As if to say, like, the over 25s were like, that's when you're getting old. Yeah, I remember people <laughs> posting <laughs> on, like, Facebook and Twitter and stuff uh, back, back two years ago when we were all turning 25. I was like, now you know we're old because we'd be in the over 25 category on X Factor. <laughs> what? I was like, what the fuck? How is... Like, I'm, like, I'm 26 now, and I'm like, well, I, don't, I feel like I should probably be used to let it into the... Uh, into just the normal category, you know? Nah, I can't do that. Rather than the Susan Boy, she, Susan Boy wasn't a factor, but you know what I mean. Yeah, I don't know what that electric cat is. It's, it's, it's a gap in my knowledge. Mm. Cartana. Cherry thing. Oregon Z. Spiritomb. Mimikyu. Magnazone. Cooper. So weird. Kind of cool, but so weird. I don't get it. <laughs> I just see it. It looks like he's taken all of Sonic's rings. <laughs> exactly. 
That's a cool hop right there. Chirachi. Giratina. Giratina's cool. 130 damage. Ooh. Could kill itself with its own attack. And there's the box. I think that's it. I think I'm, I'm just literally just holding things up. I'm, I'm vamping. Nice. There you go. God, now you can record your outro. Hey guys, thanks for watching. No, no we're not. We're never doing that. <laughs>